hard times your thoughts about something, could it be a person, a place, or an event, made you feel insecure and intimidated? Yes, that is anxiety. Anxiety is a feeling that is triggered by fear. Anxiety has been established as one of the elements that holds you back from taking that big, bold step that might change your life for good. Hello everyone and welcome to Highly Successful You. Today we're going to talk about overcoming fear, top 10 tips to overcome fear and anxiety. You'll feel threatened, intimidated, and frightened by situations that might not occur. This false alarm your brain transmits to your body creates excessive and undue worry about the things you need to do. And this will prevent you from doing those things because you worry about failing on your attempts. When you feel frightened or seriously anxious, your mind and body work very quickly and respond by showing some symptoms like restlessness, fatigue, weak muscles, fast breaths, dizziness, dry mouth, cold, hot sweat, amongst others. You must formulate a lifestyle that will work for you in getting rid of such feelings of worry about threats that might not even exist in reality, but in your imaginations. Here are the 10 tips that will go a long way to help you get over your phobias and worries. If you're excited for today's video, make sure to hit that like button. Now, let's begin. 1. Know who you are. No other person can know you better than you do. Try to learn and understand more about your fears or anxiety. Keeping tabs on the situations that provoke your fear and anxiety. You might get an anxiety diary or record to be able to accurately note down the times you experience it and what happens to you when it happens. Also identify those things that can be of help at the times you feel frightened or anxious and carry them with you whenever you are likely to face situations that trigger that feeling in you. It could be arts and scenery or any other natural artificial items that calm your nerves. Then you can go ahead to set step-by-step -step and achievable goals to help you face your fears and successfully overcome them. 2. Face your fears It is not advisable for you to always avoid situations that get you scared. You know why? Because it might stop you from doing things that you need to do or the things you want to do. Avoiding such situations makes the problem worse and would deny you the opportunity to test out if the situation is as bad as you thought or it is just a mere expression of your imaginations. You would also miss the chance to devise a strategy that will help you to manage your fears and suppress your anxiety. Exposing yourself to the source of your problems might be effective in overcoming the problem as you get accustomed to the situation and you later adapt to it through subsequent mind exercises. 3. Change your thoughts Stop thinking your thoughts are all you are and that your thoughts are the best version of you. The human mind has been designed to go through different thoughts every single day. An average person has about 60,000 to 80,000 thoughts every day, which can be repetitive or negative. The negative and repetitive thoughts about a specific thing trigger and worsen your anxiety. Find that trigger and track it down to its roots, then change the way you view it. Believing that you are beyond your limited thoughts will help you in upgrading and improving your mind to a healthier and better version. 4. Direct your focus on positive outcomes One of the things that holds you back from deciding on certain things, it could be doing a public talk, taking decisions regarding a business, goal, or any other activity, is placing your focus on getting only a negative result. Thinking, they won't like or appreciate my speech, I'll fail if I attempt doing this business, and all sorts of thoughts will only draw you back from taking the action which might eventually turn out to be successful. Tell yourself how amazing and invaluable you, your thoughts, and your actions are. The bottom line is, you won't know how it will turn out if you don't attempt it. 5. Take control of the words language you use. As you are trying to boost your confidence and overcome the feeling of fright or worry, you should avoid using words that may bring down your morale of doing the things you have to do. Formulate words or phrases that will heighten your confidence in taking action or doing all the things you need to get done without holding you back at all. The words, yes I can do it, I know I can, I'm pretty sure this will come out successful if I put my all, are phrases that will create an upsurge in your will to do all you have to do. 6. Avoid pressurizing yourself to be perfect Accept that no one in this world is perfect, 
All you can do is try to do your best and improve more on your abilities. Don't place unnecessary pressure on yourself trying to look perfect to people. Regardless, you shouldn't limit yourself to being extremely imperfect in all areas. You can try to do things orderly and in the best manner you can afford to derive the desired result. 7. Practice lifestyle changes. Practicing a healthier lifestyle, such as exercises, at least 8 hours of sleep, eating a well balanced meal 3 times a day will make you feel refreshed, take your mind off excessive undue worries, and train your thoughts. Some people's state of anxiety is triggered and worsened with the use of technological gadgets, like their mobile phones or the computer, as the first thing in their morning routine. You can try removing technology from your daily morning routine to see if it works for you. 8. Change your manner of response to situations When faced with situations that are likely to provoke your anxiety, practice a different approach to responding to such situations by breathing well and slowly. Rather than breathing high in the chest from the fear of what you feel, calm your breaths and slow them down by breathing with the diaphragm or practicing belly breathing. This will negate the effect of the adrenaline produced from the fright and flight response to anxiety. 9. Avoid treating anxiety with chemicals. Trying to treat your mental state of mind with chemicals present in kinds of stuff like alcohol, hard drugs, or pills will only worsen the situation after all the chemicals have been worn off from the body system. All that these chemicals do is mask the symptoms for a short time. They do not provide a cure to these problems. The chemicals present in pills or alcohol can even make the condition worse and lead to depression if not properly managed. Finding the root cause of the symptoms and adopting a healthier approach is preferred for a long-term effect. 10. Practice Stress Management Stress can trigger the feeling of frustration and anxiety in humans. Zoom out from work or any other day-to-day -day activity that is posing threats to your mental state of mind. You can take days off work or, in worse scenarios, walk away from the job that gives no room for you to improve your mental health and replace it with a better one. Trying to slow down, take a break, and make time for hobbies will also help you manage your stress effectively. That brings us to the end of today's video about overcoming fear and anxiety. I hope this video will go a long way to help you manage your fears efficiently. Take the reins now and be in control of your state of mind. Are there any thoughts you'd like to share? Feel free to drop it down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.